I'm Carissa Shale from Talk of the Town. In light of this week's report on the contraceptive pill, I decided to take to the streets to see what public opinion is on the issue. I 100% think that that's such a right move to make, especially girls, uh, you know, having like sex very young. The coalition wants to do that. That's surprising. I think that's yeah, way easier. No, that sounds awesome. Yeah, definitely a good idea. Yeah, it's not it's a hassle. It's always such a hassle having to book like a sixty dollars doctor's appointment and then spend an extra thirty dollars on some pills. So yeah, yeah, that's great. Personally, I believe that it should stay on the PBS just because I. I'm a uni student, I barely work, I just don't have the money at the moment to pay for it if it wasn't covered by the PBS. Um, and yeah, I don't mind going to the doctor every year for it, honestly. If sometimes, like, you're on a pill but you need to change over anyway for certain reasons, like I know that I've been back to the doctor before after a year and they've changed my pill because I've gained weight or I've gotten pimples from it and they think that, oh, we can try this one instead to make it work. So I don't think it's that big of a deal going back every year. Ah, uh, well, I'm all for birth control and making everything more accessible. At the same time, I don't see the harm in it because there are women out there who may not have access to see a doctor and they're probably at risk as well. Because it's not like you're like getting the morning after pill continuously. It's you're just already the selling it, right? Yeah. Like it's just making it easier for you to purchase it. It's not necessarily changing the pill or anything. Yeah.